welcome back. And now we're going to delve into piping commands. So we, we've seen the execution of a lot of different commands so far, but <clears throat> one of the tremendous uh, value adds that PowerShell has over other uh, command prompts or other languages is the ability to pipe uh, two commands together or connect two commands. So kind of like running them in tandem. So PowerShell does this by with a thing called a pipeline. Uh, it's just a way of connecting two commands or pipe one command into another. Uh, so it's like taking the output of the first command and putting it into the second command. So there's, I was thinking about what is a really good example of this. And uh, really, I don't know that once we get into building our football app that we'll be piping commands a whole lot. But we may, and I feel like it's something that definitely need to show you. But we're going to do the get pipe the grit process command or command lit. So I'm just going to show you what this is. It just shows all your active processes that are running, which is a lot <laughs> And uh, in my case. And um, so what we're going to do is we're going to pipe that command into the export CSV command lit. And what that will get for us is a comma separated value file. So basically put these into a file that comma separates them. So let's go ahead and we'll just get our command back by pressing the up arrow. Now we're going to type pipe, which is shift. And uh, if you don't know where the pipe is, it's the straight line above uh, the enter key. So we'll type our pipe. And we're going to invoke the export CSV commandlet and export that stuff into uh, a CSV called prox, which is for processes. That'll probably take a second there. All right, and I'm gonna go locate it in the C sports folder. And we'll see that it's right there. And if we, I'm actually just gonna open it with oh yeah, we can do code, Let's just do edit. That just gets to notepad. So we'll see all the processes right here exported. So this is a uh, exporting to a CSV is a com commonly used uh, for for lots of different data extraction. Um, and if you were say working with Active Directory and you wanted to get all the users that are in a particular user group, you know you might uh, you know run something out of the Active Directory module, uh, a commandlet that would export those users and put them and then pipe it into the export csv command so that's the basics of pipelines and we're going to go ahead and move on to the next thing